Caught on camera, this surveillance video of a massive toy theft in action. $100,000 worth of Lego stolen from Toys R Us stores around the county. And that key, key piece of the video evidence led to today's arrest, and only 10 News was there for the stick. Do you know why you're being arrested? No, I don't. Juan Camacho and his girlfriend Elizabeth Bajorquez. What have you been doing with all of the uh, merchandise? Arrested during an early morning raid at their Santee apartment. They were surprised. San Diego police say the couple, Camacho's other girlfriend Liliana Marquez, his brother Luis and another woman are the masterminds behind a major organized crime ring. And we are not talking about drugs. Primarily with uh, Lego or Disney frozen items. That's right, Legos, lots of them. Two Toys R Us representatives at the scene couldn't talk on camera, but told me they estimate the loss at around $100,000. These colorful plastic bricks are in big demand on the black market. Take a look at this surveillance video police gave me. They say this is Juan Camacho just walking right out of the Toys R Us in Chula Vista with a shopping cart overflowing with Legos, $4,000 worth. And investigators say this is Bajorquez at the Toys R Us in National City, also walking out with a shopping cart full of Legos and children's clothes on top. Since last December, the group has hit all five Toys R Us stores in San Diego County. Detectives say sometimes they got so brazen, they hit the same store several times in the same day. Watch as they say Bajorquez and then Camacho walk out with a cart full of merchandise and come right back in just a few minutes later with an empty cart ready to go again. 30 uh, crime cases basically solved today. Inside the Sandy apartment, police say they found all this evidence linking the couple to dozens of the Toys R Us burglaries. We found remnants of what we were looking for, not the mother though we were hoping to get. Police have been watching this group for months, hoping to find out what they're doing with the stolen Legos and frozen merchandise, but a check online and at swap meets hasn't turned up anything. And this isn't just happening here. A few months ago, Phoenix police busted a ring that stole $250,000 worth of Legos.